Hi, this is Graphically Alex coming at you with all things fat related. If that's something that interests you, please subscribe. I'd love to have you. So today I'm just going to do kind of a quick video on Anna O'Brien. I caught her live stream. Unfortunately, I did not screen record the whole thing and I'm really mad at myself. I knew right when she went live, I was like, I should record this. But I didn't because I was dumb. But I did listen to it and I did catch it. And so I wanted to spill a little bit of tea. But just because I could not record it properly, I do have a little tiny clip to kind of verify what I'm going to say. But it's all speculation. It's all, you know, what I perceive to have heard during the live stream. But basically... What she did is she live streamed the back of a boat for like three or four minutes, something like that. And essentially, she was kind of talking shit a little bit while she was doing it. So she was saying things like, I just want to see what they say. They probably don't think I can be on a boat anymore, blah, 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 blah. They're probably saying this or saying that. Like she was kind of talking crap a little bit. Like she was making this live stream looking for negative comments in the live stream. But everything was so positive. Everybody was super positive and super nice in the stream that was commenting. As you can see some of the comments here. But she was just like, oh, yeah, she's like, people have left because it started and people came in and then they saw what she was showing and a lot of people left. She's like, yeah, people left, blah, blah, blah. And so I think what's interesting about the whole thing to me, which let me go ahead and show the clip that I do have just to kind of verify what I'm saying. Again, it's I can't be like super on it because I was dumb and didn't record it. But then I'll tell you, I guess, my thoughts. So I think they probably think that It's pretty cool. We can end it, I just, it was just a fun experiment. Yeah, so she says, like, it was just a fun experiment to see what people would do. Which I think it's weird to go live and then, like, with the explicit intention of, like, pissing people off. That's what it sounded like to me. Which, to be honest, it was kind of this weird, like, lack of awareness of a lot of people. Because I know, like, I know there are a lot of people that hate Glitter and Lasers. I am not personally one of the people that hate her. I love to cover her, though. And I do criticize her a lot. But a lot of people in my life that have watched my videos and stuff about her, they're not, they don't hate her. They're just like, oh my gosh, you know. And so I don't know if Anna realizes, like, it's not so much that you're on a boat that people trip out about. It's like all the other stuff you were doing on the boat and, like, around the time on the boat. Like, it's not hard for me to believe that you're on a boat. I don't think it's hard for most people to believe that you're on a boat, especially if you're just safely on deck, just looking out at the waves or whatever. It was pretty... You can see all the comments. They're really positive. Um, it's just, it's weird to me because I feel like my opinion is she's kind of looking for a fight or something. Like, it's weird. And I've had this feeling about her where I feel like she does troll people or she does try to piss people off specifically to get a reaction, basically, which is what trolling is. I've said that many times. And I just find it interesting that she says in this, this is just an experiment. So she's trying to see, would this upset people? And it didn't. We can end it, I just, it was just a fun experiment. We can end it. It's just a fun experiment. She was just talking so much crap. So she was kind of just saying, like, she's kind of at that level where she just thinks everybody hates her all the time, basically. And so she does anything... If she posts anything, you can see all the positive comments. So I just think it's interesting because it's kind of like a little bit of a little bit of a screenshot, in my opinion, into fat acceptance logic, where it's like a lot of times I wonder how much of the hatred that 
these fat people experience is in their heads or is something that they're perceiving? It's just an interesting question because that was definitely what I saw in this live stream. She was really trying to see if people would be pissed at her, if people would say something about the fact that she's on a boat, if people would say things like that. And nobody did. Everybody in the comments was really positive. The stream was gone. Like I said, I really wish I would have recorded it. I promise you guys, I will record it next time. I will just do it if I catch it. Because it did look kind of boring at first. I'm not going to lie. But when she talked a little bit of shit, I was like, oh, crap. I should have I should have recorded it. And then she, it, she just ended it right after, which sucks. But yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, my impression of her with this stream that I caught was just that she's super like she was super focused on the views, super focused on how many people were in the live and looking for negative comments, which, to be honest, seems like a recipe for handling social media really badly, uh, <laughs> to be fair. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you think that this type of logic can kind of spread to other fat activisty types as well. I mean, I, I do wonder if there is sometimes an element an element of paranoia in obesity. Um, I'd be really interested to know what your guys' thoughts are on that. I know myself, I have experienced some fat phobic stuff in real life, but it was a lot more rare. And I think what really lasted the most for me or what really was a huge part of my life was the negative self-talk and the assumption of what others thought of me. So I don't know. It was interesting. I really wish that I could have recorded it. I'm so sorry. I am mad at myself, but I wanted to go ahead and just post this real quick because I got to go to the gym tonight, you guys. So I will be back tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think. Let me know if this is something that you've observed. And let me know your thoughts on her doing this little experiment. I'll talk to you guys again tomorrow. See you later. Bye.